going to be doing an unboxing of Jurassic Park, Dr. Battler versus T-Rex. Yes, I am just getting this going here. Don't let people join in. The first part of these streams is always boring. As, uh, you know, um, I'm just waiting for people to show up. go ahead and get going here. We'll talk about this. This is the newest unmatched set. We have had a bunch of unmatched sets all just kind of happen in a very short span from each other just because of uh, the way that um, COVID kind of messed up production and things with the licenses. So they're just kind of running these all out here. So this is the newest one. Dr. Sadler versus the T-Rex. So you see Dr. Sadler me and Malcolm versus the T-Rex. Oh yeah, nice box here. We're going to get into this thing. Alright, well, before we get into it, let's show you a couple things here. First of all, um, look at the size of this box. You'll be like, this is a little different. Here's the Jurassic Park 1 box here. This is the same dimensions as uh, Bigfoot, um, Robin Hood, and uh, Little Red, and Beowulf. You see little bit, this one's bigger, a little bit taller box, almost like there was something large that they had to stick into this one. Hmm. Interesting. So, are you ready to go ahead and open this? Um, I'm going to tell you, I have not really looked at much of it. I've opened it up, looked at the content to make sure everything is in there. I haven't opened up the decks. I really don't know much about these decks. So this is going to be something um, something new here for me that um, I'm going to be kind of looking at these cards. I know a little bit about the T-Rex's deck. I do not know. I know almost nothing about Dr. Saturday's deck. So this will be very interesting. Okay. Let's get this open here. You can see the nice artwork here. We got the Deratervis and the Lepica stuff. And it's like, oh, T-Rex. T-Rex foot, and here's a October one. Oh, yes, he does. Uh, oh, he has some good art on this thing. He needs more Rex art. Mm. Dr. Sadler eating because he's got to actually chop up the value. Alright. Yeah. Great looking stuff here. Oh, wait, my cat's scratching at the door. Do you want my cat to join? Last time she jumped up here on the table. Let's see if she'll do it today. I don't know. Come in. Hurry up. People are waiting. People are waiting for you, kitty. Okay. Let's see if she joins us or not up here. She'll really be in the way if she does, but she'll probably join. So oh, there she is. I mean, hey, hello, Miss Kitty. You gonna get there? Okay. Yep, you're just flopping around. Okay. Glad you are. Yes, here's Miss Kitty Baked Goods. It just took her a minute. She she doesn't, you know doesn't always show up on demand, okay? It's got to be like her decision to do it. And I'm like, oh, she does. Oh, I see. Okay. She didn't want to lay around in a good way either. Oh, we'll see. We can do this with her taking up uh, a good third of the table here. All right. Got our books here. Got these nice things. And you can see uh, Dr. Sadler's Insight Tokens. And hers and Dr. Malcolm. And what on earth? This is just that. This thing is ridiculous. Look at. You can barely hear me. Okay, well, hang on. I can try to bring that up a little bit. Maybe I can get a little more. I don't know. Um, I've got the. Oh, I know what's going on here. Hold on. I know what's happening. Yeah, I know what's happening. I have the wrong mic selected. Let me fix that real quick. This needs to be I 
let's see if this is what I, I did the wrong thing again here. Okay, let's see if this is better now that I've got the um, proper one here. I think this may work better and get rid of that buzzing. Um, yeah, I had the wrong wrong mic selected. Um, too many mics. You know how it goes. All right, so we're better here. So we'll take a look at some stuff here. We can see the map, which is this nice thing here. Oh, yeah, I like that map. We got flipped over... A Jeep there we got like a spot where um, a lawyer um, hit his um, got his demise um, this is the first map in quite a while that does not have any gimmicks on it there's no um, nothing nothing unusual going on with this map it's um, just a basic map we've got spots over on the sides that are connected kind of a little bit here and then kind of a loop going around it's interesting design but yeah interesting that there's nothing fancy going on with it oh this is laid out differently than normal yeah i'm gonna go ahead and grab this figure but um hey you know that that's you know dr sadler you know she looks fine this is a about the color of the uh, over shirt that she wore in the film so that's a good color to stick with but here this is who people care about not to say that people don't care about you Laura Dern it's just you know Laura Dern or a dinosaur you know oh my word this is like okay just this is a hefty model here guys I mean look at look at this I mean it's like what is going on with that? I mean, look, look, I mean, you know, it's the scale. I mean, I, I knew how big these bases are because we've had the design of this base for a while. We've played with it online with some stuff, and I just never, like, it did not click in my head just how big she is here. Yes, it is a she. All the dinosaurs at Jurassic Park are she's. Um, and while we're talking about minis, there's a special mini here because we do have, you know, the sidekick token, which has Jeff Goldblum's wonderful mug on it here, which is which is great. Just just love having Jeff Goldblum on there. Hell, I'm sorry. I quit quit paying attention to you for a minute. Okay, there you go. But they had a special thing that you can buy. It's a promotional thing, and that is gonna get this ready for you to see this here. Oh my word! Look at if it will focus on it. Maybe it's 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 amazing, guys. This is amazing. What what are you even? What? Ow! 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 What are you? Hey! 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 What? What? Ow! You, you, okay. I don't know. She's in a mood. Um. Anyway. Yeah, this is great. I mean, they made this many here. We knew that. One of the things that um, held up the licensing on this was, um, you know, the, the representatives for, you know, the, the actors on this, um, you know, approving everything. And I could just see, you know, Jeff Goldblum look at this and be like, well, you know, it's a it's a nice mini and it's 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 pretty good, pretty good. But it's lacking a little, uh, you know, uh, a, 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 a pizzazz or it just needs a little sprinkle of something else, just a, a little more. I, I think it could be it could be more sexy. I mean, it could be greater because, you know, people really need to look at this and be like, oh, 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 that's a that's a that's a nice Jeff Goldblum you got there. Yeah, that's that's what's going on with this. It's amazing. And so when you play the game, you have to choose between these, which one you're going to use, if you're going to use the token or if you're going to use the Jeff Goldblum Mini. Um, and for any of you that aren't sure if you want to buy this, since this is a separate thing, um, my answer to that question is going to be, why have less Jeff Goldblum in your life when you could have more? I mean, come on. All right, now before we go and pop these decks open, which I do love the artwork on these, yeah, these these color schemes are just really unique and great. I do like them. Um, but we're going to go ahead and do um, we're going to do another little presentation here. Something I've been waiting for this set to be able to do. All right, so we'll get this out here. We're gonna borrow you. We're gonna use you. We're gonna borrow borrow some pieces out of this one. Some stuff I need here. Ooh, I need to get out of this. Uh, get these Raptors here, and yeah, we'll take. 
No, wait, you're dead. Okay. And... Uh, oh, no, look, they've got her. And they just came out of the ventilation shaft. And she's there with Dr. Grant. And the two kids, Lex and what's his name? And uh, they're like around here. Oh no! Oh, they're gonna eat us! And she's like, No, you can't eat me. I, I I'm good at Linux. I can't I can't be eaten by you. And he's like, Oh no no, you can't eat me. I just like bonded with Dr. Grant, and Dr. Grant doesn't like children. Uh, the dinosaurs are gonna get them all. What are we gonna do? Oh, over here they're pinned in. Oh no! What? Bum 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 Oh no, that's so horrible. Oh, let's run away, run away, run away. Oh, here he comes. Oh, he comes in the jeep. Oh no, um, Dr. Hammond, I've decided not to endorse your park. Me as well. They go away. To drive away. And then they're all in the helicopter. And then there's a giant cat. That's Jurassic Park. Okay. I mean, you don't knock it. Don't knock it off the table. I know how you are. Okay, go up there, raptors. What, people can't play with dinosaurs? I mean, people always play with dinosaurs. They're like, you know, oh. Yes, yes. This is, this is a fertile land. And we will thrive here. We will rule over this land. And we shall call it this land. I think I'll call it your grave. Rawr! Oh, curse your sudden but inevitable betrayal. Oh, oh, the pain. Oh, oh, oh mine is an evil laugh. <laughs> okay, yeah, this is what happens when, uh, when when you give people like me, you know, plastic dinosaurs. I mean, okay, plastic is petroleum based, right? And 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 petroleum is oil, and oil's from dead dinosaurs. So are toy dinosaurs made from real dinosaurs? I, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I don't have the answers to these questions. Okay. Let's stop this. Okay, and she's gone again, and she, she knocked stuff on the floor, which is what I knew that she was going to do. Um, maybe several pieces on the floor. At least I had not separated them all. Uh, I lost something here. Yeah, we'll, we'll work it out. Okay. Because mm. I don't have... I gotta find the T-Rex dial, but yeah. Okay, which one we want to take a look at here? We want to take a look at Rexy or Dr. Sadler first. Well, I don't know anything about Dr. Sadler's deck or almost nothing. Let's get this open to take a look. This is like the first look at me looking at these cards. I'm not gonna go real in depth with these because you know, I'm gonna do that video later. And why can I never open these? Why are these so hard to open? There we go. I'm going at the wrong side. Okay. Once again, Dr. Ellie Sadler, Dr. Ian Malcolm. After Dr. Sadler, Dr. Malcolm move, place an insight token in their new space. Oh, you have five insight tokens. Oh, and then we have a separate rules card. I mean, Dr. Sadler was not going to be undone by, uh, outdone by Muldoon. She was going to have her own separate rules card. So, woman inherits the earth. Uh, I like that. You knew this was going to be one of her cards. Violent if necessary. Oh, look, welcome to Jurassic Park. Mm. You've never had control. That's the illusion. Oh, oh, it's like DNA strands swirling around her head. That's crazy. Ooh. Sexism in survival situations. I just okay. I, I, I see what's going on with the card. I think we're back in business. Okay, so this is a zero. This card's equal to the number of cards in your hand. Oh, hope you have a lot of cards when you play this. Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Here we go. Look at look at that right there. That's uh, that's just a great card right there. I mean, I think we don't even need to look at really any any of the other deck. I mean, this is just yeah, it's it's it's, it's great stuff there. Yeah, 
Yeah. Um, oh, that's a one-off card. Place an insight token in any space, and it's a one-off. Interesting, because it's a chaotician, which is, you know, on a chaotic card. Oh, there's like a little DNA strand thing going on there. That's kind of cool. Faint. She got faint. Oh, here's some life uh, finds a way. You knew this was going to be a card. I mean, come on. Life finds a way. It was going to be a card. The future ex Mrs. Malcolm. <laughs> oh, here we go. See, it's, uh, oh, yeah, we, we knew. We knew that was going to be a. Uh, Oh, I mean, look at that there. I mean, that's just like so much sexy going on there. I don't know what to what to say about that. Oh man, that's another one-off. Oh, all these one-offs must go faster. If you want the combat, you can place them in any space. That's clever. All these one-offs that um, Dr. Malcolm has lock the doors. Okay, see, there's the yeah. Uh uh uh. Didn't say the magic word. <laughs> Oh, yeah, okay, this one. Okay, this is uh, another one-off. A lot of one-off cards in this deck. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, yeah, that's a, it's a great moment there. Uh, move your other fighter up to four spaces. I like it. The concept of attraction. Oh, look, it's like dinosaurs in love, guys. And two regroups. Two one-boost regroups. Hmm. That is interesting. That is, yeah, the one-offs is a, it's an odd thing. I, I'm not sure what I think of that. It's, it's, it's odd. I mean, that does let you work a lot more references in there, but it's odd, all the one-offs. We'll have to see how those play. This is a very just kind of quick and, you know, quick and just punching through this thing. Okay, let me see if we can get, um, get oh, oh, hey, look, this one, they, they scored it for me there. Look at that. T-Rex, it's the main event. Okay, sorry. If I don't have any audio like playing through my headphones, um, my computer thinks that they're idle and turns them off and my mic goes away. It's annoying. All right. T-Rex is a large fighter. She can attack up to two spaces away. She also ends up on two different spaces. Yeah, it's like you center her on one space and whatever other space she hits, she, she's on as well. So that's, um, yeah, that's something. Um, you're just making her angry. I thought it said you're just making her hungry at first, but, you yeah, know, that would make sense. Oh, it's up. Defense you can boost. Closer than she appears. <laughs> yes. This is what I knew that was going here. This is obviously referencing that seed right there. But this is right out of Bloody Mary's deck. And uh, it, it works so perfectly for uh, for uh, <laughs> the T-Rex here. Three copies of it. Okay. 15,000 pounds of muscle. Yeah. Uh Oh, wow. Tay is out on the open water watching me. Oh, wow. Well, I'm glad I'm glad you're joining for this such wonderfully um, high value production and skill um, presentation here. It's obviously worth your time. <laughs> oh, OK. So this is oh, you get to boost it. And if you win combat, you do some damage. Ooh, that's nasty. Reckless lunge. Oh. Deal three damage to the opposing fighter and take three damage. That's where that 27 health uh, comes in. Uh, because, yeah, I think Rexy is going to be dealing a lot of damage to herself. Um, dinosaurs ruled the earth. Oh, I'm so glad that this is a card. I even like, prepared for that. Okay, nice. Four of those, four copies of that. It's just one that you can boost. 65 million years of gut instinct. Oh, okay, so you just get to pull a card other than another copy of this out of your discard pile and into your hand. Recursion, but no looping. Terrifying roar. roar. Oh, that's what it says here is her quote. See, that's her quote. Roar! I thought it would be a quote about them, about the T-Rex, like the raptors. Um, 
but no, this is just uh, it's just roar, <laughs> terrifying roar. They cannot leave their space for the rest of the turn. Ooh, man, that could be nasty. Ripples in the water. Oh, I like that. This artwork is all great too. Oh man. Okay. Oh, that's a pretty good one there. What? Why are you screaming that cat? You can come up here. Commanding impact. Okay. I was wondering what commanding impact was going to look like because I was trying to imagine T Rex in the same exact pose as uh, Sinbad and Luke Cage and these little arms. I was just like, how are you even going to do commanding impact? That's pretty good. Makes me wish there was a momentous shift. So, you know, you could have this little T-Rex arm just like stick it up like, <laughs> oh, man. Oh, three copies of commanding impact. Oh, there is a momentous shift. Oh, but. Okay, I guess it's the head sticking down. Oh, a little disappointed. I wanted the big, you know, T-Rex thing there. Oh, oh man. But that is such a great moment from the show there that it needs it. All right. Uh, yeah, so... So, Sadler and, um, and Malcolm, a lot of one-offs. That's going to be weird. That's going to be crazy. Um, T-Rex, we'll just see how this beastie plays here. Because she doesn't have a whole lot of defenses. We've been talking about how many defenses she has. Okay, all the defenses she has. Well, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten defenses. Three of those are momentous shift, which are traditionally much better as an attack. Um, and then some others here. Yeah, so so not a lot there. Um, yeah, yeah, so not a lot of damage, not a lot of defenses, and she does damage to herself, so I can see how she can, um, you know, how she can be taken down. Also, you got to remember that whenever she's on the board, oh, the back of this is something similar to, um, What's on the back of the uh, other Jurassic Park board there? Just the location of the T Rex paddock on uh, with this Isla Nublar or something like that. Mm. But anyway, when she is on a space, you know, you, s you know, if she can fit on another one, then she's in both spaces, um, and she can be attacked from both spaces. And you're also in both zones when you do that. And there's some maps that you know. You could end up in, um, you know, end up in some stuff that you wouldn't normally, um, zones that don't normally cross over with each other. You could end up in both. Yeah. So, anyway, this is uh, what we got going on here for T-Rex and Saddler. Uh, we can see the insight tokens, which are these little things here. And the health dials there, which I'll put together. i got to find out where my cat threw the, uh, oh, there it is. My cat threw the, oh, dang off. This is why I don't let my cat on the normal videos, because it would be, like, far too disruptive. Yeah, but just look at this. Look at this. Look at this thing. I mean, that's just, like, what is, is what, what is this thing here? That's just. I know, I'm just saying, what is this thing? But come on, I mean, Dad, it's just like, whoa. Oh, just arriving on an island. Well, kind of want to know where Tay is going right now. Um, but anyway, anyway, that's what we got here, guys. I know a lot of other of y'all are excited to have these show up. Going to be excited to see what both of these fighters can do. Um, we'll get um, a good look at these. I'm going to get the... Um, Nice video out for the um, Hell's Kitchen fighters. Um, what happened before um, T-Rex and Saddler. Um, just to get those finished up. Because it's going to take me a little bit since I'm really very blind into these. And just haven't seen much at all on these. Um, so um, we'll have those come out. And then I'll be getting into, um, getting into the other... Um, 
and to the other ones there. But anyway, um, that's what we got. Will, you coming up here to make one last appearance? No? You staying down there? All right. All right. So, yes, we're finished up here, and we'll, um, we'll be around. I'll have some other videos um, around later.